Not less, we are live today inside of the Less Is More Lounge, which happens to be underneath the main floor of the Grand Ballroom. They put us down here. This is where they put us. This is the kind of respect we get. No, I'm just saying. They got sound check going on up there. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. But we're lucky to be sitting here with a couple of guys from Mudvayne. I'm here with Ryan Martini, the bass player. I'm here with Greg Trivet, the guitar player. Thank you guys for your time today. Thanks, Thanks Ben. Thanks, Ben. And by the way, congratulations. I'm lucky enough to have already listened to the new CD from Mudvayne. The new game is fantastic. Thank you very much. <laughs> you guys are so excited. You got to listen to it today? I did. Awesome. I listened to it a few times on the way down here because there was a few tracks that I wanted to, uh, to play because they were some of my favorites after listening to it. Cool. So right congratulations, on. guys, over the last couple of years. I know you guys have been busy kind of working towards this. And uh, tell me a little bit about the process of taking a couple of years away from Mudvayne. Well, really, a couple of years away you, from Mudvayne? Well, really, Mudvayne's been busy. It's really busy yeah, the whole Mudvayne's time. Mudvayne's been busy even though Hell Yeah has yeah. been doing that thing, too. Yeah. Well, we, yeah. wrote, we, we wrote and recorded uh, the new game, and uh, that's been over a year and a half ago now. Yeah, actually, the record's been done for a year. And just sitting there waiting. Yeah, so waiting. Waiting. Wow, and then, okay. you know, we had time. And then we just did another one. Yeah. We wrote and recorded another record that we got in the hopper. Yeah, so, uh, <laughs> so we have been very busy. It's not like, but I mean, may have not toured. We may not have toured, but we were definitely working. Well, and, and talk about, I want to ask about the evolution of the band, because there is a a distinct change, I don't want to say in style per se, because it definitely is Mudvayne, but there almost sounds like a, a direction of progressiveness, where there's some time changes that are crazy, some, some time measures that are in there, there's some vocal breakdowns that change song to song. Was that a conscious effort when you guys were recording and writing this album that you wanted to do something a little bit different than you've done in the past? Uh, I think it's just maturity, man. We've been doing this for so long, touring and writing records, and I think, you know, we've learned that we can it's easier to write together. I mean, at, at first it was complete chaos. <laughs> each record keeps getting a little smoother and cool. Now we know each other's kind of irks and tweaks and everything. And so it's, 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 I think it's a natural progression for the band, actually. And one of, the, one of my favorite tracks, you know, when you, when you get the new game, which hit stores on Tuesday, sitting here with the guys from Mudvayne, when you put it in your CD player, the first track is going to pretty much blow anybody's mind. The, the bass playing on that track alone, I think, pretty much sets the standard for the, for the entire CD. So, nice job on that one, Ryan. Thank you. Nice job, <laughs> Mr. Martini. Nice job. Uh, you know, Mr. Trippet, you're not so bad yourself. <laughs> no doubt. Yeah, absolutely. And I actually wanted to play that track for, for, for everybody tuning in right now. This is an exclusive new track from Mudvayne on the new CD that's going to be hitting stores on Tuesday from the new game. This is Fish Out of Water on 101.7 The Fox.